Hi everyone, I'm Brandy with everyoneandthensome.com. I'm Daniel with Spiders Daniel. This is Daniel, and we're here to talk about what we're going to be learning this week. And I'm going to change it up from the previous ones, and we'll see if you guys like this better. Um, I'm just going to briefly outline our core subjects, and then we're really going to be talking about the specialized item that we're focusing on this week. So, our core subjects are our hooked on phonics. Yeah. Yeah. And today Hi. we've graduated to lesson Hi. five. Learn to read. Which is AM. What's AM? We're going to learn that this week. We have a new special guest. We're also still working on our handwriting without tears. Yeah. And we're progressing through this very quickly. Um, on the bigger letters, and then I have a whole bunch of smaller worksheets that we're going to be doing for this program. As usual, we're continuing with our little Mozart piano program, and we're, we're having some troubles hitting the keys hard enough to make the loud sounds and soft sounds with just one finger, so we're really going to be working on um, technique and dexterity this week in our so, we are finishing up our bugs study. So we have a couple of books we're going to read about bugs. We're going to take a break from our bedtime poetry book this week and read Butterfly Eyes and Other Secrets of the Meadows. And it's poetry all about the meadows and butterflies and bugs. So that's our poetry. We're also, not this week, but the next week, we're going to be starting our kindness study with our 40 days of intentional kindness so as kind of a bridge we're working on be nice to spiders and then I saw this book in the library look at the art in this book I may have to do a book reading about that I don't know I haven't decided yet but I love the graphics in this book this is called the timekeeper and it's another type of poetry um, let's see, as we talk about being nice, we have a couple of books about being nice. We have Help, I Really Mean It, and The Nice Book. We also have, look at this one, you're going to like this one. Don't forget the bangers. The Interrupting Chicken. The Interrupting Chicken. Okay. So that's going to kind of round out our bug study and our start our kindness study but we really want to work this week on patterns we're going to be doing skip counting counting by twos counting by fives just like we did last week and to do that we'll be working a lot with our bears these are our counting bears from learning resources and when we talk about patterns We'll be working with our Coda Pillar. Our Coda Pillar. And I got these flashcards from the dollar store, and these are same and different. We're really trying to recognize when things change and how things change. Same, different, patterns, sequencing. Those are the um, things that we're going to be studying this week. So, talk about patterns. We're going to be doing a lot of repetition and rhyming. So, I have. The book that Jack wrote, quite a funny book. I mean, just really quite strange and funny. And this is a riff on the house that Jack built. I'm sure a lot of you have heard of that. And so we're going to be using that to talk about what happens next and what happens next and what happens next. And then finally, this kind of bridges things. We're going to read How to Heal. No, don't turn that on. We're going to read How to Heal a Broken Wing. So, cap it all up. Patterns, kindness, we're going to be finishing up our bug studies. Um, no more bugs out of Play-Dohs, we're done with that unit. We're going to talk a little bit about butterflies just to bridge over into the life cycle of a butterfly into the sequencing. Uh, okay. okay, and so that's it. Um, I hope you'll give this a thumbs up and share and subscribe and take a look, go over to my blog and take a look on that and find out, I'm going to be talking about how we're putting together our 
40 Days of Intentional Kindness calendar. And we're going to be reading some books and we're going to be doing some product reviews. We're reviewing the Bears and the Coda Pillar in the coming weeks. Um, so I think that's all. We'll see you later.